Um, so good afternoon. I'm Marguerite Tan. I'm the Director of Environmental Programs with the National Pork Board. So today I'll be talking about verifying our commitment to continuous improvement by pork producers across the United States. As a reminder, please hold all your questions to the end of this session. What I want to do is start out with this question of what is sustainability? Sustainability looks different to everyone, depending on perspective. So it looks different to Pepsi, it looks different to Walmart, and it looks different to pig farmers. I think of sustainability as a vehicle. We are all on this road driving to the same location, but we are driving different makes and models of vehicles, and we're taking different routes. And that's okay. For the pork industry, though, we think sustainability is best defined through the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. The UN has created a global framework for alignment and communication of sustainability through 17 sustainable development goals. I won't read through this list, but they include goals such as zero hunger and responsible consumption and production. The UN has a fantastic definition of sustainability, which is meeting the needs of the present without compromising the ability of future generations to meet their own needs. Or in other words, to meet the needs of today's generation without sacrificing the needs of future generations. Note that these goals go beyond the environment into both social and economic areas. Pork producers are utilizing these sustainable development goals as our North Star for setting these strategic targets. To align with the UN Sustainable Development Goals, pork producers are leveraging an existing producer program called We Care. So let's talk a little bit more about that We Care program. The We Care initiative has been around for more than a decade. It's actually about 13 years old and is, a, and is based on producer commitments to continuous improvement. It represents six ethical principles which producers live by every day. They are our values. Um, they are food safety, the environment, our people, animal well being, public health, and the community. The six We Care Ethical Principles generate this holistic approach to sustainability and become the platform that expresses the pork industry's intentions and values in the food system. The six We Care Ethical Principles ladder up to the UN Sustainable Development Goals. As we're talking about this, I want to highlight the word holistic in this approach. Pig farming is a natural biological system. Everything is interconnected. If we adjust one thing, there can be consequences in other areas, such as if we decrease barn stocking density, it actually will increase our heating fuel needs. So it's important to keep this in mind as we set these goals, because we need to make sure that we balance the impacts from one area on another. Through this holistic framework, we're leveraging these We Care Ethical Principles as the basis of the pork industry sustainability platform and the validation involved to build consumer trust. So building consumer trust is very similar to an equation. Principles plus practices plus proof builds public trust. Pig farmers have been doing sustainability for decades. The difference is sustainability is now mainstream on the consumer's radar. Consumers want proof points to validate their trust in the product. So to show proof, we have identified metrics which can be measured, verified, and reported. Through these metrics, we're setting goals and commitments. So goals, metrics, and data. Goals allow us to show our progress over time. Data shows proof of our commitment to this continuous improvement. So let's look at an example of where we've come from, and then we're gonna look at 
where we're going. So our productivity is a cornerstone of our sustainability. Utilizing 1990s production technology, we would need an additional 25.9 million more pigs than what we need today in 2021 to produce the same number of pounds of pork. Through continuous improvement, we've been able to reduce the number of pigs needed by almost 20% from the 1990s to meet today's pork demands. Pig farmers have been measuring themselves and improving their practices for decades, but there's never been a standardized system to measure improvement, which is what we are coming up with now. Which brings us to our guiding principles. Our guiding principles for setting goals and setting metrics are simple. They're producer led with one unified voice and validated through proof points. Utilizing these we care ethical principles, our producers have come together through task forces over this past year to create sustainability goals for US pig farmers, developed by pig farmers for pig farmers. These goals are backed through on-farm practices, which are practical, implementable, and cost-effective at the farm level, so they can readily be adopted by producers across the U.S. Participation by producers is 100% voluntary, so we want to ensure that producers see a benefit to these practices. So we're talking about real pigs, real pork, and real sustainability. We will provide proof of moving towards these goals through our data. The proof is in our data. We are utilizing the EcoProducer platform to create standardized on-farm sustainability reports, which third-party verify, track, and quantify the on-farm sustainability story. The data collection includes agronomic practices and other metrics rooted in the We Care Ethical Principles. Currently, the platform has been rolled out to producers in the Midwest and North Carolina, and the platform is being expanded into the rest of the United States in the next year. The sustainability platform from this report is the key to this framework. So let's take a look at what that actually means. The sustainability report measures on-farm metrics and provides third-party verification of producer practices. These are just a few of the metrics which are tracked on the sustainability report, which are translated into benchmarks such as water security, air quality, and biodiversity. We also wanted to ensure the sustainability reports provided value to producers as a farm management tool and as a scorecard that they can present to their customers. Once we have the sustainability report, we're gonna utilize this information as a springboard for a sustainable continuous improvement plan or a skip plan. So let's look at an example of this skip plan. In this particular sustainable continuous improvement plan, you see highlights in soil, water, and biodiversity. It shows producer progress, short-term goals, and long-term goals. For instance, for this particular producer, a long-term water goal is to use soil moisture probes in the future to monitor crop water needs. This will allow the producer to apply irrigation water and effluent most efficiently via center pivots and ensure water and nutrients are not wasted. Through this framework, we can set goals for the industry, which we can measure, verify, and provide proof to the customers. This returns us back to our We Care ethical principles. So due to time, we are going, I'm unable to actually 
walk us through all of the commitments and goals which the industry has set. However, what I wanted to do was share with you what these look like. So I'm going to show one of these to you. All of the industry commitments ladder up to these six we care ethical principles of pork production and ultimately the UN Sustainable Development Goals. So we're going to look at just one of these, which is food safety. The food safety ethical principle means we're committed to producing the safest food in the world. One of our supporting goals under food safety is by 2030, 100% of fresh pork products can be traced back to suppliers using technology that allows consumers to easily access information on how that pork was raised and produced. This means a consumer can go into the grocery store, scan a package of ribs that they're purchasing for their family, and learn about where that pork came from. In the slide deck for this session, I've included a couple of other examples of these goals and commitments for you to look at on your own time. Each of these areas have metrics with data proof points for third-party verification. This framework is focused on real pigs, real pork, and real sustainability. Through this holistic framework, which was designed by producers with a focus on building consumer trust, we're confident that we can show proof of our commitment to continuous improvement and sustainability. Thank you for your time today.